What's up everyone, Ryan here, and today I'm going to be playing a full true simulation round at Augusta National playing as Jordan Spieth in EA Sports PGA Tour. So those settings are as follows. As we take a look at the difficulty settings, we're on simulation, but even harder than the default simulation because we have hard swing difficulty putting, no swing meter, no zo ability to zoom in on the shots, which will be really tough when we're on the greens. We have all the wind reading information and elevation as direction only, so we don't know the exact number. And the biggest thing, we have putting grids or green grids turned off. So that is the big thing that makes this extremely difficult. It is the max difficulty settings in the game. And on top of that, we're also going to go into the settings and going to go into visual settings and we are going to be turning off the putt meter as well. So not only are we not going to have the swing meter, we are not going to have the putt meter and we're going to be playing in 8 to 12 miles per hour wins tournament conditions for the masters. Let's do this everybody. If you get some enjoyment, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more and I have tons more EA Sports PGA Tour content on the channel. If you want to see more, including gameplay tutorials, a full career mode series, and much more. I have playlists linked in the description for y'all if y'all want more after this one. But let's go ahead and dive on in. Now, from Augusta National Golf Club in Augusta, Georgia, set amongst the azaleas, dogwoods, magnolias, and pines, this is is EA Sports coverage of the world of golf. Rich Lerner, so pleased to be joined by Frank Navalo. And Frank, the setting here at Augusta National, as always, is ideal. You could just sort of sit and watch and soak it all in, but you have to get out there and play. So what are the keys to being successful here? Getting used to the uphill and downhill lies. Uh, and you see that on what is regarded really as the most perfect par five ever created. That's 13. Because if you had a nice tee shot and you're gonna go for that, uh, go for that green across the tributary of Ray's Creek, then, then you better used to be having the ball above your feet. And of course, then you get to 16 and I'm gonna steal a, uh, a line, you know, from uh, the great Vern Lundquist. Yes, sir. And yes, sir, you know you're playing a beauty. And here we go. It is time. Augusta National, Jordan Speed, Max True Simulation Settings. Let's send it. I've been having a blast playing True Sim Settings in this game. Usually I play with the grids on, but no beads. Because you can turn off the, the lines that move, but still keep the grids. Or you could do what we did this round for some reason. Why did I do this? That's a good question, you two. Down on the course, let's good check question. in with Nota Begay the third. 113. Ball sitting down. Needs to get a little bit steep to dig it out. Yeah, I mean, we're here in the second cut. Should be able to hit well from here. We actually, we were in the pine straw. They gave us a nice little relief. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, maybe the caddy talked to the rules officials, gave us a good lie. Got a nice relief there. Gonna do full loft on this one. I send it. I, f the wind is ripping. That eight to twelve miles an hour really sent it. Well, well as an old uh, baseball announcer once said, "Going, going, gone. Goodbye." Going, going, gone. Indeed. Wake up, Jordan. <laughs> We're gonna hit my favorite spot, my favorite shot, the spinner, full loft. Yes! <laughs> That's how to get the morning off on the well, right that'll foot. get the that'll nervous shitters out. <laughs> quickly. It is a chip in birdie here at number one. That'll get the nervous shitters out. Um, Okay, what a start. We need all the birdies we can get. My goal is to get to even or better, and I've never finished even close to even without the green grids here at Augusta. Oh, that's trouble. Well, that's not going to help us. I, hey, you ever seen the movie Legend of Bagger Vance? Well, well that ball came in. Well, you're not going to see a scene from that movie. That you do not <laughs> like. Are you still the my the golf course, the leaves, the branches, the trees, and then ultimately well, into the hazard? I saw that going differently in my mind. Can we move it back from the bushes? I always forget about that creek being there. Yeah, we'll, we'll get a scene. Legend so of Bagger Vance. And now go about trying to somehow Captain save Captain Juna, Juna is in the wood. To the par five. 
and sends it from the woods into the hole. Well, never mind. <laughs> I don't think that shot is possible. So we're just going to punch this out. You'll just have to watch the movie to see that scene. I love that movie. It's one of my favorites of all time. That's about the best we can do. That hurt. I don't know what I was thinking there. Just mis misplayed it. Okay. 64 yards, pitch shot in hand. Spinner has a bigger, bigger like range dispersion zone, but I still like it. It's a great swing. Go in. Too much backspin. Now this, this is when it gets feet. tough. It was so much easier when we didn't have to putt on the last hole. So th the problem is with. I feel like the best way to play True Zoom is to turn on zoom just when you're on the green. Because you can't move around at all to look. So you can only see on these four views. That's it. The ball is below the feet. It looks like to me left to right. But I could be wrong. Oh, out the first time playing without the power meter too. That was a pretty good first read. This game's unfair sometimes. Game's I'm unfair like sometimes, so way. true. That's a bogey. So the good work he did at the first erased here at the par five second as he taps in for his bogey. I'm sending this. Spieth is upset. Spieth just wants to full send this drive. But that you know. Looking a little right. Oh, that's beautiful. A bogey after that shot and is great. Look at this. Wind up a little straighter than the first two drives. It's in the fairway here at three. Speed sent that one over power, over swing. It's a good drive. Not your standard approach here. This is second from behind the green. Gonna go the spinner shot again. Short swinged it. Yeah, just by 4% short swing. This will move to his right for birdie. Yeah, it's definitely left to right. 1.2 degrees below the feet there. That is so tough to... Yes, a second oh, we did of the it. round. So, a nice bounce back from that bogey at two. Hey, if you all are drinking coffee... Figures at one under for his round. Whatever you're drinking today for this round, cheers, everybody. Coffee here in my cup. What a birdie. Seven wood in hand, 241 yards. Definitely not hitting the seven wood. I'm gonna go for the finesse shot. Four iron down the slope. I just wanna hit the green here. I'm gonna aim way to the left. Oh, miscalculated. I was just trying to land it on the left side of the green there. And this is not, not where you want to be. Get there. It is going to wind up in that right front bunker here at four. I'm going to hit the Second pick shot. shot. Coming up. Notice down there. Popular place here at the fourth. Many players finding their balls in this front right bunker going to require a perfect execution to still have a chance to save par. Right. Perfect execution is what we do, Nota. Actually, that was pretty perfect. Oh, the hands came through beautifully there. Good thump of the sand and a good chance to save par. 1.6 degrees above the feet there on the ball. Now, unfortunately, I know you all are warning about the HUD. I can't turn off turn off any other of the HUD elements. I can't turn off this, these, the bottom right of the screen. Beautiful. Yep, good solid stroke there and a nifty up and we down. We are one under through four. Side bunker. I've never broke even on these settings here. Not even close. This is my first time playing here without the power meter. This course will humble you fast though. I'm just having a blast playing this course. I've played it so much in this game already. Yeah, that's a nice swing and the result never gets is going to be a tee shot that is set up just fine. Okay, Gotta 216. Think this an extra half club or more. As he sets for a second into the wind. Yeah, I think we've got to go knock down shot, knock it down through the wind. Seven wood with full loft as well. Oh, that's that's too much. We've got to go four iron. It will probably land too short, but I don't want to send it past the hole. We're off the back of the green. I'd rather miss short. 
Or let's just send it off the back of the grain. <laughs> well, that works too. In the second cut. And not a great result here. This going to be into the second cut. I think we've got to flop this. Not an easy shot. White good. Wow, that, say, that thing so, bounced smashed. so much. Yeah, size of a putt left. On that down slope, that good is such a difficult shot. Here, 22 feet away. 1.4 degrees, ball above feet. It looks to me like a steady right to left, but also I feel like I'm guessing a lot. So let's pretend I know what I'm doing. Yeah, it's going to be right to left, up the slope, aim about 10 feet past, and put it in the hole. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Imagine if it would have went in. We have a tester coming back with the shadows here. Always blow the feet. Hit it pretty firm. Okay, a good putt. It's Beautiful. in for bogey, and it's back down now to level par. We'll take a bogey. I mean, hey, we're still even. Still within the goal of even or better. I think I go finesse shot here. It's downhill significantly. We don't know the exact amount. Gonna do full loft in this wind. Still might be maybe too far. Under swing by a mile. Not a mile, but 4.4%. That's a good shot, though. We can and that one not put this on the in, green, maybe. But not in a terrible spot, either. Sitting up in the short grass. Is it crazy that I'm thinking about Texas Wedge here? Yeah, that's crazy. Let's just hit the spinner shot. We already chipped in. Uh, we're not chipped in. We spun in the spinner on hole number one. Let's get another one. Great touch. That's why I love that shot. Break a little bit right to left. We just saw it. So that safely in for his par, and he'll remain level. We are sitting on his open even nine. par at Augusta National. Jordan Spieth, you got this. It's so fun to play the game on these settings. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend it. it it's so much fun. It's hard, don't get me that wrong. We'll do just fine. But I wouldn't want it to be easy. Second shot coming up, and we say hello to Iona Steven. Well, 122 left to the flag and the pin on the front portion. I think knockdown shots to play. 124 uphill. It's probably gonna play about 132, something like that. In the wind a little bit as well. So I think the 48 degree wedge here, full loft, oh, that's, that's too much distance. Go like 134, we don't want to land it short. Well, this is straight out that's of beautiful. a really good line. Go in. <laughs> Rich, is that eight or nine feet? <laughs> Not that bad, but it is a great approach shot. I mean, it looked like when it was rolling back, it was breaking left to right. Did you all see that as well? I want to say it's it's left to right a little bit. I had a putt similar to this before. I think it breaks more than you think. Oh! Mm, a good opportunity. Hit it too hard. There. Plus 2% power. We had the line. That was such a great knockdown shot in the wind as well. Okay, that's finished off for a par. All right. Send it. We were playing some great golf though. This is so much fun. I'll tell you this long and long and, and that with a little bit of breeze behind it's long. We haven't he even used the, the caddy book yet, He's gonna but have a good look coming up. 195 to the front of the green. There's a gap right through these trees, right? 
Am I crazy to think that? Yeah, I think I am, but I'm still doing it. <laughs> yeah, I should not have went for that. This is going to be an extremely challenging shot. Uh, and that In the second shot roll. on this par five, it just came out too low. Came out like a bullet. That first bounce, it wasn't going to stop. Second bounce, it wasn't going to stop. And just ran over the back. Going to flop this with full loft. See if we can get it to stick. Wait, this can't go far enough, can it? We've got to go to a high flop. Or maybe even a long flop. No, I think high flop in the wind will be fine. Go in. Oh. What a golf shot. You saw the break. This should be a simple putt. It's so yeah, easy to well overpower it. Birdie there and it puts him into red figures as well. Moving to one under par. That's a must birdie hole. We are sitting one under par within the goal of even or better. We're striping the ball beautifully today. It helps that this is my most played course in the game, but still, it doesn't make it easy. Beautiful drive down the hill into the big clearing, and it'll set up a good look at this ninth green. And I'll be doing more courses in the game on True Sim as well, so stay tuned. Well, from this section of the fairway, you have an opportunity to get the ball close to the back third of this green. It's going to require some good calculations on yardage and proper execution to get the ball to sit on the right plateau. I think we just land at the kind of the top of the green here. I don't think we I think we actually de this, get a little more distance and spin. Well, I didn't mean to put. Do I have fade on it? That's an accident. That's a great shot. I didn't want to spin it too much and, and roll it back down the hill. Very good in the air. Just doesn't quite finish up that near to the flag, but still on the green. I think this game plays so well in True Zone for a few reasons. Number one, you can really see the with how good the graphics are and shadows, you can really see the green undulations and shapes, or at least I can. Maybe or like I can't see anything, Ryan. That'd be true, but and also I they need to add a view that's lower because all we have is this right for true sum you should be able to look lower like you would in real life walk around simulate walking around which you can you can simulate that by turning on zoom and only using it when you're on the green i didn't want to do that for this round but i think i will from here on out this is probably two feet uphill a lot of break left to right at least i think now as far as distance here i have no clue this is all guess Pretty good. Yeah, he wanted that to go a little more, but that's not too bad from there. With the way the putting stroke is on this game, without the putting meter, okay, it feels so weird part. for me. You're at the ninth. That is a and one under on the front, though. This is a one under 35 on this first nine. And the reason I don't do a lot of shot shaping, some of you are probably wondering that, I can't hit the diagonal swing. So you 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 don't it all that matters is the beginning and end point, but it's still extremely hard, and I just I just avoid it. That's why. Simple as that. I can't hit it. But we didn't need to. And like so many players, they hit it down the right side. The problem there is you're coming in from the wrong side of the fairway. You got to that second shot very close to the edge of the bunker that protects the right side of the green. Okay, we got this. 176 down the slope into a headwind. I think this is another ability, another time to use that knockdown shot in the wind here. With a 8 iron. It's down the hill, so it's going to fly a little bit further. Under swing. That's unfortunate. Good shot. The um, wind added yeah, quite a bit of backspin. on the green. <laughs> Less said, the better. Price, he's not taking driver out for this one. It's a long ways away, though it is for birdie. Wait, do they, does, do they want me to pull out driver? I can't actually do that in this game. I have been known to do that in PGA 2K21 and 2K23. 
Steady right to left, hitting this very firm up this hill. That's a great swing. Oh, this is going to be a tester. These are the knee tremblers on this setting. Shadows make it so tough to see. Ball is below the feet. Just saw the break. It breaked quite a bit from what I saw. Up the slope slightly. Yes! Okay, so the approach left him better than 50 feet away, but a good two putt is wow, going to let him walk out with a par. We are fighting. Keep up the fight, Jordan. This is so much fun. It's funny. My two favorite ways to play this video game. Well, that's unfortunate. Our simulation and arcade, the complete opposites, right? Now, got to manage the pine straw here with his second. I see a gap here. You all thinking what I'm thinking? A punch punch shot all the way down? I don't know how far this is going to go, but de-loft it a little bit more and just send it. Maybe we should have done the full approach shot there, but I still think it would have hit had a dangerous like it would have been dangerous because it could have hit and bounced way to the right or left. That was a smart shot. For his third shot here, looking to get it on the green with this. 76 yards downhill slightly, gonna do full D loft. Land this it the wind's gonna affect it not as much as you think, because it's not gonna be in the air much. It's gonna affect it. We'll take it. But this is for par. Looks to me like steady right to left. Ball is above the feet. I wish you could put the pin in and out as well for true sim to see like the direction that the flag is tilted. That would be very helpful on these settings. Get in. Got it there, but Good read. not quite on target. Can't be upset when you're that close, right? Really good putt. Cleans that up in the hole. Back to even. Goal of even or better. And we have the beautiful, beautiful view. I'm gonna take a screenshot here. It's gorgeous. It never gets old seeing this view. I don't know about you all, but it's something special. But now we got to hit the shot. We are 172 down the hill into a headwind. Probably looking at the knockdown shot here just to be it a little bit safe. High wind knockdown just to make sure that we do not hit the water. Sent it. That's not a bad shot, though. And that one going to continue off the back of the green, but it shouldn't be too bad from back there. That never gets old. Never gets old. We, we got to putt this. Texas wedge from the fairway. Ball is above the feet. It looks like steady right to left. Down the slope quite a bit. It's going to be a quick putt. Crushed it. Good tempo, but absolutely crushed it. Saw the break, though. It should be basically okay, straight. Okay, I think you know, ultimately going with the putter there, probably a good decision. Yep, straight in. Yeah, good concentration there. That's a distance where a putt could get away, but that in for a par. We have six holes remaining, sitting even par. Goal of even. I've never <laughs> done it on this course. I've actually never done it on these settings so it'd be a new record for me already is yeah, a new record that's technically take the slope of the fairway and ease its way on down 
A very good tee shot here at 13. That thing was sent. Now, after the big drive, this a good distance here for a second. To so the we're left five. 193, 175 to the front, 191. We don't want to land in the creek. So play this a little bit safe on the approach, full loft. No, seven iron full loft. Take a little bit off and send it. It's going to come off to the left with the lie angle. Then the wind's going to pull it right. Anything but the creek. Beautiful. Safe shot, but at the end of the day, do we want to be in the creek? I don't. Maybe you oh, all do. What a shot, Frank. I mean, this is one you think about at the start of the round. The second at the par 5 13th at Augusta National, and that's how you draw it up. To get it off that uneven feet. lie and carry Ray's Creek and, and hit it on that skinny little piece of grass. What a great second shot. It's a great shot, but there is a whole lot of break here, and we cannot risk hitting this too far. It could roll off the green into the creek. Oh, what an effort. It's going to be a tester for Birdie that we need bad. A straightforward look here for Birdie. We just saw it roll down the hill. It was flat, right? Don't make up break when it's not there. Yes, it was. Yes, nicely done. It's in for birdie, and it's into red figures now at one under par. Cheers for that birdie, everybody. Get your coffee, whatever you're drinking. We are playing some insane golf. up in the wind maybe drifting a little left that thing was sent and that a good shot up the hill and into the fairway at 14. from the fairway we check in with noda hole definitely sitting in the go zone if you can hit your number ball could get really close we we're gonna hit the number Noda. i'm doing full d loft so it doesn't spin as much going Full attack mode on this pin. Underswing is not attack mode, Jordan. Pretty good, though. Ah, uh, good shot. Safely on the green and a birdie chance. This for birdie misplayed now. the win there. And not a particularly demanding putt here. Maybe slightly down an incline, but it is dead straight. There is steady left to right here. Oh, no, that, wait, I read that wrong. There was no break. Welcome to uh, five foot putt Augusta here. National. Ball above the feet. It's going to be steady right to left. We just saw the breaks. We got to hit this one, right? We just saw it. I'm a little nervous, as you can tell. <laughs> yep, good work not to let that get away. And that's in for a par. Four holes left to make history here. Jordan Speed is sitting one under par here. Sent that one. That's what it's trying to do. Overpower fast. This is a must birdie. The question is. Just what you want at this point in the round. You're trying play to it find safe the rhythm. Or hit lay back. Fairways, hit the middle of the club face. That's what they did right there. A lot of danger ahead, but a good opportunity is second and 15. I mean, we got to go for it, right? I mean, I'm going for it. I don't know about you all. I mean, kind of a safe go for it. That's perfect. That is gorgeous. Wow, I love this game. Okay, Frank, he'll be happy with that one. This 15th hole presents its share of challenges on that second shot. That was well done. Its name is Firethorn, Rich, and that water in front so often puts out somebody's fire. So that is two great shots. Ball is above the feet. To me, it looks like a steady right to left. I don't think I've actually ever had this putt before. Look at the putter. Go what is Jordan doing? Look, that must be a... What is, what is Jordan doing? Hey, settle down, Jordan. 
He's nervous? <laughs> you see him shuffling his feet? The, the putter's going through the ball? Settle down, Jordan. <laughs> his nervousness is making me nervous. Go, go. You gotta hit it. Good read. Jordan was making me nervous with all that feet four movement. Four-footer here for birdie. Settle down, Jordan. <laughs> yes! Yes, a two-putt birdie. That's in for a four. We are two under par right now. My best on these settings is like six over. And that was around us playing insane. So, we kind of came to play today. Full loft on an eight iron. Finesse shot. Going right for it. When you're on, you're on. You grill him back. Yes. Keep on rolling. What a golf shot. Just That's incredible. That's a shot to hit right there. You know the wind is at your back. You tee it high and just let it go. Get it up there in the jet stream. And that's just what he did. He's going to love that. The fans here to see one thing. Or sorry, patrons. Not, they're not fans of the Masters. 2.3 degrees above. Steady right to left. Oh, oh my. No way I would have read that much. Hmm. Let's say he should have made that. Well, welcome to Augusta National. <laughs> Extremely challenging putt, but hey, we'll so take a par. For his par, we'll keep him at two under for his round. Stay focused. I'm not even gonna say what score we're at now. You already know. You've been paying attention. <laughs> this game plays so good in true sum. So good. No problems there. That's gonna wind up safely in the fairway. From the, the fairway, courses noted, are so well made. Is second. 151 yards to the hole. Pin is very accessible here, right in the center of the green. The nest shot, gonna go up to 158. Let the wind really pull this thing. Be the club. Be the club. Pretty good. Misread the wind a bit. It, it uh, blew it way more close, to the left. But uh, safely on the green. A long one coming up here for birdie. Slight downhill. To me, it looks like left to right. I'm going to get pretty aggressive. Get in. Oh. What a read. But we have a tester coming back here. Balls above the feet, steady right to left. One time. One time, make this. Yes! Okay, can't take putts that length for granted. What a battle. That's in for a par. Two under going into the 18th hole. I never thought I'd be saying that at the end of this video. Thank you for all the support and all the encouragement throughout, everybody. I know you all dropping those one times, leaving the encouraging comments. You legends. Yeah, I cannot believe this is best golf I've ever played. Through that narrow opening, and that is going to work out just fine. This is by far the best I've so ever now, played. Up the hill, the second at 18. 152, uphill, full loft on this. Get up! Get up! Get up! Nope. Underswung big time. That was the club, though. That's got to be disappointing. Good line in the fairway. Yeah, very disappointing. Coach winds up in the bunker. We got to play this safe. Full loft on the pick shot. We can stick this. Okay, pretty big swing necessary there, and that's not all that bad from that far away. I think there's a lot of break here. 1.8 degrees ball below feet. It's a steady left to right. We didn't really get a lot of information. But for all the patrons here at Augusta National for the Masters, let's make them proud. Gonna get aggressive and we're gonna send this putt in. One time this one, everybody. Say it out loud, leave it in a comment. You know what to do. Yes. 
Yes! Yeah, that's good putt. It is we did it! For his par here at 18. That is one of the best rounds I've ever had. No, not one of. That is the best round I've ever had in this game. No green grids, full simulation style. We just shot two under par at Augusta National in high winds. Let's go. That was insane. What a fun round of golf, though. That was awesome. Beginning to end, just so much fun. We had to bogey. We birdied the first hole, that spinner shot. And then we bogeyed two, bogeyed five. Ended up battling for one under on the front. Bogeyed 11, bounced back with the birdie on 13 and 15. That is a one under front, two under back. An incredible round of golf here from Jordan Spieth. You all are all legends. Thanks for never giving up hope in me. If you got some enjoyment in this video, drop a like. It really helps the channel. Subscribe for more. And I greatly appreciate all your all's support on the channel. Like you all are all legends and it means so much. In celebration of my best round of golf so far on EA Sports PGA Tour. Get on over there to my second channel and subscribe. Gamer Ability 2, link in the description to it. We're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. If everybody who watches this video to this point, everybody does that, we probably get to 1,000 on the second channel. Let's go, everybody. Thank you all so much. Plenty of other EA Sports PGA Tour content on the channel, including a full gameplay tips and tutorial series. Link in the description to that. A full career mode series. Link in the description to that. And also, I have a link in the description to all of my gameplay videos for EA Sports PGA Tour. But I will see you all in the next one. As always, have a fantastic day, everybody.